Uh, this was a mouth watering. You can grow it. Some of Idaho's fresh fruits are now ready to be picked. That includes apricots and cherries. Peaches and apples aren't far behind. In today's You Can Grow It, our garden master Jim Duthie takes us to a fruit farm for an up close, delicious look. Take a drive through rural Canyon County and you'll pass a number of large orchards growing a variety of delicious fruit. And some of it is ripe and ready to pick now. The Treasure Valley is one of the most productive fruit growing regions in the country. Peaches, nectarines, apples, apricots, and these beautiful cherries. Cherry Hill Farms is one of those fruit growers sprawling across a gently sloping hill just north of the Snake River. The cherries aren't the only fruit they grow here. This area, they call it the Banana Belt of Idaho, right here along the sunny slope. And it is a very well suited for growing apples, peaches, cherries, nectarines, and apricots. In fact, the apricots are ripe and ready to harvest. This is a fairly new variety called Robata, and it produces a larger, sweeter, smooth skin fruit that's gaining in popularity. Just ask Sean's son, Kellen, who is the farmer's unofficial fruit taste tester. The orchard's busy season is from March to November. Apricots bloom first in late March, followed by peaches and cherries in late April. Apricots are ready to pick in June, cherries in July, and peaches and apples follow in late summer and fall. In the spring, the farm hosts a spring blossom tour when the orchards explode with blooms, making for a perfect family portrait. And did you know that fruit blossoms are either white or pink, depending on the fruit? So the pink blossoms come onto uh, peaches and nectarines. Our apricots have white blossoms, our cherries have white blossoms, and our apples have white blossoms with a pink hue to them. But the namesake of the farm is cherries, and after a couple of tough years for cherry growers, this year has produced an abundant crop of juicy red cherries. These trees here are very productive, and this is actually about a normal crop for this size of a tree. This particular variety is called a Montmorency tart cherry. They were used to be grown a lot for pies and desserts, and now they're mostly dried. They look just like a little raisin or a craisin. They're a little more tart than raisins. We sure like them. And Callan approves, once again giving us the thumbs up that these cherries are delicious. Now how do you know for sure when the cherries are ripe and ready to pick? So, so we know these, these, this specific cherry is ripe when we can grab a cherry and pull it off the stem and it doesn't rip like this one did or leave the pit hooked to the stem. That's different than sweet cherries because with sweet cherries they pick the stems hooked to the cherry still. That maintains them fresher longer. Where we, in our packing process, we take, we remove the pits from these cherries. We don't want the stems hooked to them. So we will make sure that we wait until those cherries come completely off the pit, off the stem, intact with the pit inside the cherry still. Hand picking millions of pounds of cherries would take forever. But a mechanical harvester makes the process much faster. A cherry shaker gently grasps the trunk of the tree and shakes it for four or five seconds. Cherries fall onto sloping tarps and into a tank of water, which prevents the soft, ripe cherries from becoming damaged. The, the few cherries that stay on the tree will we'll leave there and, and they'll fall off and, and go to organic matter into the soil because we only pick these trees once. The farm's fruit stand is now open for the season and there's fresh produce from the vegetable garden. You can even pre-order fruit that will be harvested later in the season. And coming up in a couple of weeks is the annual harvest tour, a fun family event. Enjoy wagon rides and ice cream, and watch the cherries being harvested, or even pick your own. Cherries are ready to harvest now, and you have an opportunity to pick your own. These delicious fruits are ready to eat. For Idaho's News Channel 7, I'm Jim Duthie. Ah, oh, Jim is a peach of a guy, isn't he? Cherry Hills Farms is located in the Sunny Slope area southwest of Caldwell along Chicken Dinner Road, the world famous Chicken Dinner. For more information about the upcoming harvest, tour and fruit sale, check out their website. We have a link posted in this story on our website.